first snack in true African fashion. Of course, of course. These are called Simba, Simba Roars. They're called Simba Roars? It even has a lion. Perfectly fitting, well played South Africa. There's peaches on this thing. Peaches, 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 peaches. So they're chutney balls and the brand is Simba. So Simba balls? <laughs> no! Simba balls! Uh, Update, they are not balls. No, they were peaches. They are chips. It's It smells very strong. Whoa! Oh. Yo! That is one of a kind. It's like a barbecue chip with peach flavoring. Mm -hmm. It's like very tangy, very sweet. Those are it's, delicious! It tastes really good, but I'm not crazy about it. You are crazy if you don't think those are delicious. They're good. They're unique. South Africa, I'm on your side, okay? These are fantastic. <laughs> I think we're starting off really strong. I'm giving this a nine. Wow. A nine out of 10. Wow, that's a great, that is a great bag of chips. I don't know if I can feel the same. I'm gonna give this like a six. Wow. Yeah. Hey, Kurt, have you had lunch yet? I have not had lunch. Then it's time for a lunch bar. <laughs> it's just called a lunch bar. Much, much more lunch bar. That was a great one. Oh, that was <laughs> cool. We got that on camera. It looks like a like a crunch bar. It looks like a monstrosity is what it looks like. It, what is this thing? Okay, it is crammed with wafer biscuits, caramel, pe oh, peanuts, and crisp rice. There's gonna be a nice little crunch to it. Wafer. I'm liking the wafer. Ooh, cheers. cheers. Lunch time. Ah. Oh, dude. There's so much happening. Dude, yes. This could be the best dang chocolate bar I've ever had in my entire existence. If a Kit Kat and a Twix had a baby, lunch bar. I'm just surprised they didn't come up with a more creative name. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. You got me sold, mm. okay? Eight out of 10. That's it? I'm sniffing the 10. It's, it's more. You're gonna give it more than a 10? I'm gonna give it an 11. 11 out wow. of 10. Wow, we have not had an 11 out of 10 on any item in this snack series. Oh, this is good. This is history. Well done, South Africa. Yeah! Hey, Sam, are you still hungry? Uh, yeah. Great, because we're about to eat some more. Eat some more mini shortbread biscuits. I love how they just decided to spell every word wrong. <laughs> and then slap it off as the name. So is it gonna be a sweet treat or is it gonna be a savory bread-like cracker? I have a feeling it's gonna be a little milky. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. yeah, that's good. I wanna eat some more, hold on. You wanna eat some more? You know what, oh, oh! I know exactly what these taste like. What does it taste like? Those cookies in the blue tin during Christmas time. Oh! Oh, yep. You mean the ones you're supposed to keep sewing kits in? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's, yeah, that's, that's exactly cool. what these taste like. I'm gonna give it a six. Yeah, I'm with, I'm right there with you. Six it's, out of ten. Not it's, bad. It's not but bad. Not amazing. Not bad. It's definitely something I feel like we've tried before. I will attest that it does make me want to eat some more. The next one we have coming up might just be my favorite. It is jelly tots. Well, I. I'm confused. Jelly tots. Let's let's oh, go. Oh, wow. it is oh. a white chocolate bar, and you can see. Oh look! You could you could break it off into pieces here. Whoa! Oh, I don't know how I'm gonna feel Whoa. about this. Whoa! There's a little piece of jelly in all of these white chocolate bars. I already know I'm going to dislike this. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. The oh. white chocolate is good. Oh, the yeah. jelly is just so confusing. It's growing on me. I hate it, I hate it. <laughs> I'm at a four, because of the chocolate, mostly. I don't think I this is a choice, this is a preference that I would I would eat all the time. I'm at a seven. Wow, a seven. what? <laughs> Please let me know in the comments, if you are from South Africa, if you would willingly purchase a white chocolate bar filled with gummy candy. I don't think I would, but- You I'll just gave it a seven! I know, but that means seven's a C. If I was hungry, I would eat it. Next, we have two packets of Oma Buttermilk Rusk. Oyuma, Oyuma. Oh, 
I like that. I like Ouma? that. Ouma. That sounds legit. Like, yo, Ouma. Yo, like, pass me one of those Ouma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ouma or Uma. Either way, a buttermilk rusk resembles a bougie Rice Krispie, I think. This is something that I feel like would be like given before a meal at a fancy restaurant. This is really nice. Cheers. Cheers. Ouma. 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 Yeah. <laughs> I hope we're saying that. I know. <laughs> Mm. What does this taste like? It tastes like nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's just crunchy. It doesn't really have a taste. I'm sitting at a five. It's right there in the middle. I don't hate it, but I don't love it. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm more, I'm like a seven. If I want a snack or a treat that's not overwhelming in taste, this is great. I feel like we should be dunking this in coffee. We should. Let's meet our next snack. Bada bim, bada boom. We have some Tex. What? That's it. That's just, that's just what it's called. It's called Tex. Why is it called Tex? <laughs> the lighter side of life. Mmm. This is um Twix by itself. This is South African Twix. And listen to the description of this. Might sound familiar. Okay. Milk chocolate with a center filled biscuit wafer. Mm, okay, I'm noticing a trend here. These wafers, chocolate and wafers. Text me, text me. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, I can't wait for more chocolate wafer. Oh, yeah. Wow. Mm. Oh, mm. okay. There's so many layers of chocolate. There's so many layers of stuff in one bar. I think I will give this 7.5. It's it's okay. It's good. I like the crunch. Mm -hmm. I like the airiness. Mm -hmm. Flavor is good. I'm at like a seven. Mm, okay. Sam, do you have the Riz? <laughs> so that's a no. Because <laughs> I have the Fizz. Errs. So these are called Fizzer, uh, which feels like a gummy stick. Okay, they also yeah. have strawberry and they have, what, what are yours? Cream soda flavor. Oh, that's crazy, okay. Wow, look at, whoa! I'm actually a very big fan of this. <laughs> this is how it moves? I'm a sneaky, sneaky snake. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> it's so good! Oh, look at that, so satisfying. Sam's more excited about playing with the food than actually eating it. <laughs> it's so chewy. I know, it's so chewy. <laughs> Strawberry is definitely the move. I feel like most people will agree. I'm at like an eight. Yeah. Because I love Starburst and this reminds me exactly like Starburst. I was originally at an eight, but I have realized that I truly have never quite experienced texture that was like this in any kind of candy I've ever had in my life. And I'll give it a nine. Whoa, a nine. This is the reason why it's getting a nine. Look at this. Just because of Look at this. how we can play with it. Look at that. Oh! <laughs> Wow. All right, y'all, for our next snack, we got the bar ones. I guess that's what it's called. Which we have two. We have two. Bar ones. So this little guy is a bar one, uh, because maybe you only need one? It says that bar one will give you energy for a 25 hour day. I'm definitely not eating this whole thing because I'm not trying to stay awake for the next 25 hours. Mm. So there's caramel in the middle uh, and guess what, a wafer. This tastes exactly like a protein bar. Four grams of protein. Mm. 67 grams of carbs. It's gotta get you through 25 hours, man. I don't know what to say. No <laughs> way, 19 grams of fat. If you ever want to make someone fat, you just give them this to gain weight. Actually, this would be like an amazing hiking snack. Maybe if I got stranded for <laughs> a survival situation. <laughs> hey, a bar one and we're good. We're good. Every bar is worth 25 hours, all right? We're good for another 25 hours if we have one of these. I'm sitting at like a three. I'm not about it. I'm a 25. Out of 10. <laughs> you shut your mouth. I'm at like a five. Like, I feel like if I wanted something like this, I would just eat a protein bar. <laughs> Sam, are you old enough to drink? Mm-hmm. Good, because we have Maynard's Original Wine Gummies. Wine Gummies. Is this alcoholic? I don't know. <laughs> I think they're just called wine gummies. I'm terrified. Is there alcohol in this? Apparently South Africa knows how to party. 
Let's go. Wait a second. I have an idea. Your wine gummies, sir. Yeah, yeah, it's quite smooth here, right? It actually smells really good, right? <laughs> wine gummies. Pinkies? Pinkies up. Pinkies up, here we go. <laughs> oh my god. It's exceptionally chewy. It Why is, is this minty? It is kind of minty. It's almost like licorice minty, but it's not quite licorice. These are interesting. They're in very unique, very, very unique. Please tell us in the comments if these are actually made from wine or why they are called wine gummies. I am at a firm seven. I think a six, but the uniqueness, again, South Africans, I don't know what you're doing with your snacks, but they are truly one of a kind. If Johnny Depp had a full glass of these, would they be a mega pint of wine gummies? You don't know the mega pint? No, I don't. We got Fizz Pops. More like Riz Pops. <laughs> so, girl? So, you want one of these Fizz Pops? I got you. <laughs> So we got a couple of fizz pops, which are clearly lollipops, but it's the fizz that I'm interested in. Like knowing the flavor profile of all of you South Africans out there watching. Knowing the creativity of South African candy. Yes. I would hope this thing makes my mouth fizz. I think it will. Three, two, one. Wait, stop. Hold stop. on. Wait, one, two, two three. There it is. Ah, that, was that was good, that was good. All right. It's not fizzing yet. Tastes like a lollipop. Oh. It mm. looks like something is in the middle. Oh, yeah. it does. Oh, dude, it might be like a like a pop rock or something. Time lapse. <laughs> Do you have a hammer? <laughs> <laughs> ha ha! Oh, 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 who's inside? Fizz! Alcohol hit! Oh, no, 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 There's legit powder inside. It's, it, oh, it's sour. Mm. But see, I feel like I have to work harder. Something about the texture of this. That was that was worth it to me. That's fun. Really? No, oh, I'm not a fan. I'm gonna give it a five. But again, South Africa, you guys are very unique. I've never tried anything like this before. So I'll give it a 0.5. 5.5. I'm at a seven. Really? It's fun. It's good. The flavors were good. That that was great. That was great. Fizz pop. Yeah. Hey Sam, but what do you call it when you have a relationship with someone that's kind of short and quick? Like, I don't know, like a quick quickie? <laughs> a fling! Of course it's called a fling! What was I thinking? Fling. These are flings or a original maize flavored snack. Maize? Oh, like corn! Oh, oh they're Cheetos! They're Cheetos! Corn Cheetos! Look at this. They're puffs! The corn puffs! What flavor is this? Corn. It tastes like corn. They said, good to know that they're baked, not fried. But get this, it says tartrazine free. <laughs> what is that? What mean? is that? Cause it's like, what, I mean, what else is in stuff like this? Like, is there is there a snack that we've tried that does have tartrazine? And what is tartrazine? It tastes like seasoned corn. Nice. It's a fling. You can fling it in the air. I am sitting comfortably at a 7.5. Mmm. They're good, but I'm not amazed. You see what I did there? You see, you see what? I, I'm not amazed. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like these. You know what? Cheetos are up there for top 10 in my in terms of snacks. Okay. So I'm, I'm gonna give this a 9.5. What? Yep. Because it's tartrazine free. You're an idiot. That's <laughs> why. Well guys, that is all of our snacks from the South of Africa. Gotta say, I loved a majority of these. Uh, very interesting and fun. Yeah. And a lot of new experiences. But yes. that is it for this video. Make sure to thumbs up and subscribe and leave a comment. Tell us what country to try next or just what you wanna see us do next. But until then, sharp sharp, and I'll see you later. Goodbye. <laughs>